Okay, here's how we add a custom food. So we hit save until it goes into the program mode. And now I'm going to enter in my custom food number 001. It can be anything you want up until 999. Hit save. That you can see calorie is blinking. Now, for this because it has a decimal point, let's say that I had 49.5 calories. What I do to enter in 49.5 calories is I say 0 four nine five and then hit save and now you can see that it is 40 I'm sorry 49.5 calories and then the next uh, we have fat that's blinking and same thing because it's a decimal point let's say that this was 25.5 grams of fat I go zero two five five and save now you can see that it's 25.5 grams. So because there are three digit codes with a decimal point, if it's a two digit number, you have to add a zero in front of it. If it's a three digit number with a decimal point, um, then you have to basically, I'll, I'll show you that one here in a second. Um, but let's go to cholesterol and let's say that that's 300 milligrams of cholesterol. So I'm going to do zero, three, zero, zero and save and then I go to salt and let's say that was 45 gram, uh, milligrams of salt so 0, 0, 4, 5 save and carbs so let's say that this was 300.5 grams of carbohydrates so now what I do is I go 3, 0, 0 and see the decimal point uh, and then I add 5 so that's 300 0.5 grams, um, and that's how you enter that into the scale. I hit save, and same thing here. Let's say that it is only now 300 grams, um, so I would type in 300, and see there's room for the decimal point there, so I just add the extra zero. Now I'm 300.0 milligrams, and I hit save. And now for protein, I'm just going to add in 45.5. Uh, Oh, sorry. And if you make a mistake like I just did, then you just hit um, clear and it'll start you over again. So you go 0, 0, 4.5. So now I'm at 4.5 uh, grams of protein. And I hit save. And then it'll ask you for the amount of weight. And it's typically 100 grams. And I hit save. And it's going to set it. And I'm all done. And that's it.